UMass Boston baseball at home on Wednesday afternoon, taking on Plymouth State University, a Little East Conference matchup. It's a home-and-home home series, so this one at home for the Beacons, looking to move to 6-0 in Little East Conference play, and they get on the scoreboard first. Breon Parker scoring on a wild pitch by Tyler Hicks, makes it a one nothing ball game, and then the Beacons would give up three runs as Ross Dexter, a throwing error right there on Jackson Curtis's fielder's choice, scores the tying run, and then Luke Sikolsky's two-run double makes it a 3-1 to one Plymouth State Panthers lead. However, three was the magic number for the Beacons as well in the third inning. They'd come back with three runs of their own to regain control, and it would end up leading to eight unanswered runs for UMass Boston. This one is Breon Parker kicks it off with his RBI single to right field, and then Aiden Blake, an RBI single of his own. Blake would finish this game with four RBIs. This would be his first of the afternoon. And then Craig Corliss, who led the team in RBIs last week with a big week and also leads the team in RBIs over overall for the season with an RBI single to center field to put the Beacons ahead 4-3 to three, and they continue to tack it on as Blake would get his second RBI of the afternoon on this sacrifice fly to Alex Reeves in right field. Now keep in mind with Reeves on this very next play you're going to see him make an incredible diving catch against Nick Palma as you see this ball skied out into right field Reeves going back to the warning track lays out makes the grab and the inning is over but the scoring would continue for the Beacons. Three more runs in the sixth inning. Mariana Jimenez now getting the Beacons on the scoreboard again with the sixth run of the afternoon, makes it 6-3. to three. Justin Gavea, the freshman who had a big week last week as well, makes it 7-3 to three with his RBI single up the middle. And then Drew Metzdorf with an RBI double to center field makes it an 8-3 to three ball game. And at that point, the Beacons in control. Ross Dexter only needed to go five innings. He gave up three runs, all unearned. Seven strikeouts, four walks, two hits. He'd get the win in this one to move to 3-1 and one on the season. And we're going to see Boston Burris as well get in on the action, making the start at first base in this game. An RBI single, his first RBI of the season. And then Aiden Blake capping off the day. With a big two-run home run, his third of the season. The Beacons win this one 11-5. They move to 6-0 in Little East Conference play. They remain atop the Little East Conference right now as the only remaining undefeated team in LEC play so far this year. And they get right back at it this afternoon, taking on Tufts University tonight at 7 o'clock p.m.